You know how we do Fridays here. We do them with a zip trip. And now it's time to check in with Tucker, who's going to tell us all about the shopping local in Fairfax County. All right, he escaped the slide. We'll see what he's up to now. Morning, Tuck. What we find at Fox 5 that is going to know something about shopping? They've gone to the right guy. All right, I got Ashley and Monica. Yes. Ashley, celebrate Fairfax, right? Yes. And Monica, these are your beautiful goods. Yes, they are. Oh. Um, from Clayish. Okay, and we'll talk to you in just a minute, but let's talk Celebrate Fairfax. Absolutely. All right, tell me uh, what's going on. Sure. So, Celebrate Fairfax, we're a 40 year old 501c3 nonprofit mm -hmm. that was founded in Fairfax County to celebrate Fairfax County and its communities. Um, so, we're able to accomplish our mission through bringing people, different entities, businesses together to create meaningful experiences. And events and our organization tries to build up that sense of community so we've been um, our latest endeavor has been the park at Tyson's which is where Monica comes in with Clayish all right tell me about the uh, park at Tyson's so the park at Tyson's um, our organization took a vacant space and turned it into a vibrant place for the Tyson's community um, last year we did a community uh, engagement survey to name the building which is mm -hmm. park and it stands for people arts recreation community and so at the park, we've been doing a ton of different activations. And are we looking yes. at pictures of it? Yes, and actually that is our block party. So we just finished up our Fairfax karaoke uh, competition last weekend. We have food trucks, local brews, and then our signature program has been our monthly shop local market. And we've been featuring local Fairfax made businesses, um, artisans and crafters at the park. All right, that's very cool. And yeah. does it go year round? It does go year round. So we have a shop local market coming up on September 10th, which Clayish will be there. All right, time to make a transition. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me about your beautiful stuff, and uh, you just told me this is like your side hustle, right? Uh, yeah, I do this. Right, I, tell, I, until it fully takes <laughs> off, and then you'll and then this will talk to us. So this is what I do. This is um, handmade modern wearable art. All right. Um, it's polymer clay jewelry with a twist. Um, it's very lightweight. Um, I base all of my creations on neutral tones. I'm um, using, you know, some fun patterns, some fun textures, but keeping it within the very simple and easy to pair with with any outfit. So that's basically um, the whole concept of it. They're I, beautiful. So tell me what inspires you. Like, how do you, I, I would never know what direction to go in. Is oh, it just from looking at other jewelry well, or how well, do you, how I do have, we know what you're going to do? Yeah, well, I have a, a background in ceramics. Okay. So that's kind of where it all started, right? I always had an interest in doing jewelry and I discovered polymer clay, which is so fun, so versatile to work with. And, you know, my inspiration is everything that's around me, everything mm -hmm. that's neutral, everything that's na natural inspired. Um, but I kind of, you know, applying all of those techniques. And if people want to see more of your stuff, tell everybody where they can find you at this market. Well, I'll be at the market um, okay. on September 10th and also on my website, which is clayish.com. Mm -hmm. So you can find all of my collections of earrings, um, hair accessories, and the variety of necklaces. I love it. Yeah. Um, yes, I don't, I don't have any money in my pocket, but otherwise you'd have sales right now. All right, for more on Celebrate Fairfax, where can people find more information about what's going on in the community? Sure, so go to our website, celebratefairfax.org, or check us out on our social media, and we'll have our uh, vendors posting about our shop local markets and where we're celebrating around Fairfax. Great. I'm yeah. very grateful you both got up. I assume you don't normally sell earrings at 6.30 in the morning, but... <laughs> you never <laughs> know. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> All right, real quick look at the weather forecast. Beautiful out here this morning. Everybody's doing great. Uh, a little breeze in our hair. We are currently 74 degrees. If we go to the seven-day forecast, I just want to show you quickly. It's just summertime here to stay, so perfect for getting out and enjoying Fairfax as uh, we will be right around 90 the next couple afternoons. If we flip to a, uh, another map there that shows the seven-day forecast, if not, you just have to take my word for it. We'll get an afternoon thunderstorm in the next couple of days. All right, apparently that's not going to happen. Claire, I'm going to toss it into you. 